Wow. Welcome, Taurus. <laughs> Welcome to the spirit. Oh my God, Tauruses. Congratulations. I don't know, Tauruses, but you're like, it's not happening. It's not happening. Congratulations, you Tauruses. Wow, Tauruses. Okay, this is definitely, definitely um, a period, Taurus. You Taurus women are crowning this reading. It is as if it's not happening. It's not happening on my book. It's not happening on my watch. No, it's not happening. It is not happening. All right. Let's see what you're working with because you're standing your ground and you are looking over what is happening and what is transpiring. I see truths are now being revealed. I see some of you Taurus, uh, Tauruses are um, looking at your enemy and really recognizing who your enemy is. And I see a lot of you Tauruses is going to be finding out uh, that an Aquarian has been speaking behind your back. And um, a Gemini was trying to, um, a Gemini is actually trying to resolve some sort of a problem. Um, this Gemini is dealing with um, an Aries woman or an Aries or a Sagittarian woman. Um, um, and you are overseeing this project and the situation, the Ten of Swords. The truth is coming out. So an Aquarian is going to be speaking up and speaking the truth. Whoever the Aquarian is and whatever is happening and transpiring, an Aquarian is finally going to be speaking up the truth. Now, Taurus is, there's a lot of of major you have a, a lot of you Tauruses wanted um to leave a company but then I see you're going to be not doing that because you're going to be finding out who has been creating a whole lot of chaos and you're going to be finding out and receiving a whole lot of information so this is actually absolutely wonderful um because a lot of you Tauruses is going to be recognizing um that um, some sort of uh, affair that has transpired. And when we speak about affair in business, it's about uh, um, some something that was created in the past. You're going to be recognizing that this situation was created on false uh, um, ground. So let's say that some of you um, had given someone some sort of a new start, some sort of a new contract, they took on someone, you're going to be recognizing that uh, Aries um, or a Leo person or an Aries person um, had come to you um, in um, with some sort of a um, communication that wasn't true. So it is as if you got someone, some sort of a position or um, someone came to you um, at the, in the company and was telling you um, and giving you information that was not above water. So, however, this is coming up and transpiring is that this energy is that you gave someone some sort of a position and now it's recognizing that this person cannot manage their position. Okay, because the energy of the fool is that uh, um, this it's about happiness moving forward, but this energy of the fool is in the reverse, and it's about uh, no, you're taken back. Let's say that you offer someone a position, they're in the position, and it's not working out. It's about Uranus, okay? Um, it's about the sideways. It's about the rebellion. And the re revolution, because obviously you gave someone um, some sort of a start and in the past and you recognize that this person um, giving you the, um, it's as if this person um, tried to show up for themselves as if, you know, yeah, you know, I'm good at this and, you know, I'm very good at this and whatever. And now this person has this position, but this person is not performing in their position. Okay, so you're like, um, you know, you're very disappointed and you're going to be making some sort of a change. Okay. In the first week, we're looking at the magician in the reverse. So obviously that is not working out. And obviously you recognize that someone um, manipulate some of you Tauruses in getting 
some sort of a date or information, okay? So someone could, um, you know, ask you for some sort of a date and information and you're not recognizing that it's not this person date and information, okay? So some sort of a communication that a Leo person um, spoke to you because now a Taurus is recognizing that this Leo was very dishonest, okay? And it's as if the story is a woman is coming back to some of you and is saying, hey, didn't you recognize that the information that the stories had given up and this Leo has given up was not based on reality? This person had manipulated a situation. So I see, you know, when we look at the Mercury, Mercury is the energy of uh, the magician and um, Mercury is about communication. It's about the fast moving um communication and speed and uh, communicated but it's not happening because of some sort of information about a leo or about a aries leo or a sagittarian person that came out and it's as if you ladies are standing on this you ladies are really on top of this woman you ladies are really standing your ground on top of this woman you ladies are like putting your foot down against this woman because if you notice you ladies are sitting on top of this woman head and putting your foot down and trying to make sure that this person has no access um to your company no access to any more information and data because you recognize that this person um is not it is not speaking the truth okay so Whoever this Aries, the or fire sign woman is, okay, because this is like an Aries um, person. It's coming up as an Aries person, but it has the energy of an Aries and a Leo. But it is, um, um, for most of you, it's going to be an Aries person that they're going to be recognizing that their Aries person um, at the workplace was not speaking the truth. That this Aries person manipulates. You can see the energy of the magician is a manipulating um communication so this person manipulates something some sort of a, commu a communication whether written communication or verbal communication in order to get some sort of a position and now they are recognizing what this person have done so um they're also recognizing that this woman have manipulated situation in order to um let it show up as a project or um, a project was theirs or they were running a project or they were running a business and now people are recognizing that this person has been very dishonest because it's not true. So when you see the energy of the seven of pentacles comes up, this is about Saturn in Taurus. So the energy of, um, of this is about Saturn in Taurus. This is about, um, someone, someone manipulating a situation, um, showing up as if, it's either they have gone to study and have finished a study or they have um, some sort of a business or project and it's theirs, but people are now recognizing it's not true. It's not theirs. People are now really recognizing who is the manager of this business and this project. So this, this person was, you know, kind of pulled the wool over your eyes in the past, Taurus, and then you, Taurus, woman is now standing your ground and recognizing that, yeah, um, the information and the data that is on this lady, uh, CV, correctly, and Vitter does not uh, show the potential of what this lady is showing up. So it, it could be that some of you are calling back the, um, head hunter or personal officer to say, hey, um, this doesn't, this, this, Something isn't wrong here because uh, the credential that this person have, their performance is totally the opposite and we need someone else. So um, a lot of you Tauruses could be standing up and coming down and you're, and it's as if you Taurus woman is going to say, this woman has, um, you know, manipulate or, um, or formulate some sort of a mascot in order to come into this company. I don't want her to do this to another company. And I see you women are going to be standing your ground. And the, um, I see determination, standing your ground and discipline and um, really standing your ground so that this woman. So I see 
um, Saturn in Taurus, where I see you ladies, you ladies are going to be firing this woman. Okay, you are going to be standing your ground and make sure that this woman is fired. And they are going to be making sure that also this woman company, some of you are going to get this woman fired, but also they're going to be making sure that this woman company shut down for what this woman have done. And it's coming up as an Aries person because it's definitely the four of ones and it is Aries. So, um, Venus in Aries, but no, because you Tauruses are going to be firing this lady and making sure that this lady do not create uh, this illusion and anyone be caught up in this illusion. Because um, this it is an illusion whenever people lie um, about their uh, study and their capability um, because they disillude people so that they can get something. And this person was... Uh, um, showing up saying that they have certain um, study and that sort of a thing and it wasn't true and people are now recognizing because I see you Taurus women are on top of this and recognizing that in the past this woman has created some sort of a manipulation and uh, manipulate and career some sort of an illusion um, um, by uh, communication or written um, showing up that uh, this person study and the rest of it, and they're going to be recognizing that it's not true. And um, they're going to be recognizing that this person tried to take over a project or said that they, they have worked there or um, they have built on this project or they have worked on this project. And a you Taurus woman is going to be recognizing that it's not true. And I see you Taurus women are going to be standing your ground so that this woman do not... Uh, um, career this illusion for anyone else moving forward in our future. You're going to be shutting this down as, as if uh, you're going to be making sure you're going to be calling up the right people to shut it down because this woman, um, have created a real illusion by some of you are going to be recognizing that this woman um, falsify someone else's information and got in a company and they're going to be recognizing what this woman have done. So I see um, a lot of you are going to be taking down this person and you're going to be making sure that this person do not do this to another corporation institution again because you're going to be um, ending it, ending her contract and making sure that uh, um, this person don't get away with the lies that she has created and the illusion in order to get in um, some sort of a corporation by using uh, someone else's data and information. So this is it where the Aquarian could be going through and is investigating and is looking at uh, and is trying to figure out. So Aquarians are like a, a personal officer and uh, um, company lawyers are checking on this person curriculum and checking the places that they say that this person at work and is trying to identify this person and they're going to be recognizing this person is not who they say they are because they're going to be recognizing that this person is not true. It's not the right person. It is the, the, the information, the document is correct, but the person who carries the document is not the right person. So it can be in different scenarios where basically you Taurus women are going to be sitting down on this and making sure um, that a contract, um, a business contract that this woman um, wants, they, this this Aries, they are Sagittarius person is not going to get it because they recognize um, that it's not their company and it's not their business and they have been using someone else's data and information and they're going to be recognizing this. So Taurus says, you're really standing your ground. Ladies and gentlemen, if you'd like to see the extended of this reading, please um, uh, follow us to the other side. It's just $1.99. You can use the first subscription to check it out. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Please like, share these videos. Um, and recognize that, you know, Taurus is no one can pull the wool over your eyes because you're seeing through the illusions of people stand your ground, take back your power and like, share, subscribe, subscribe, um, subscribe these videos. 
um, this is going to be a good, good period. A lot of you are going to be getting some sort of a promotion. If you're thinking of starting, um, you know, a little business on the side, go ahead. Um, namaste until next time. Money is looking good also.